Hello. In this short video, I'd like to demonstrate how to generate Gold Effect 3D text. I'll be using the Environment Map option, a feature that I'll deal with in more detail in a future video. Welcome to this tutorial, the 13th in the series. I'll make a start by changing my default title slightly. I'll change the bounding box type to fit box to text and bring the text up into the middle. I'm going to change the font to a simple but bold font. Simple because more complex fonts may give undesirable results. I'll change the font to Arial Black. I'll now go to the Global tab. Make sure that the padlock on the scale handles is locked and drag the scale sliders out to increase the size of the font. I shall now go to the Style tab and apply a texture to the face of the font. Select Image Video and I'm now going to scroll down the textures to gold. By the way, all these textures should be bundled with Title Pro. Open that. I'll now go to the 3D Controls drop down and set an extrusion of 5. Then down to the bevel controls, select the diagonal bevel and increase the bevel to 0 0.5. Then down and check the include backside checkbox. Now regarding the bevel size, it's important not to make this too big or the font could be distorted. I'll just go to the global tab and increase the scale just to make sure that the font is still okay. And that looks okay. I'm now going to rotate the font so that it's edge on. I want to see, you see this where this extrusion is too big. I now need to reduce the extrusion so that the bevels join up to make a nice clean point. I'll go back to the style tab the 3D controls drop down and using the small arrows on the extrusion reduce it until I'll just go back to the global and zoom in a bit more so I can see that a bit better back to style 3D controls Carry on reducing the extrusion until the bevels touch. And you can see that now the two bevels, backside and front side, are touching. Now I'll just double click the rotation arrow and 
As you can see, that now looks fairly impressive. But just watch what happens when I turn on the environment map. Go to style, 3D controls, and click the environment map checkbox. I'll just rotate it so you can see the effect. That's pretty impressive. So as you can see, a great looking effect achieved relatively easily. Thanks for watching. Until the next video, bye for now.